What's up, survivors? Welcome back to another episode of Enshrouded. And uh, I know it's been a few since I posted something on the game, but I just got back from vacation. Um, so I'm ready to post a little bit on uh, Enshrouded again here and get to playing. And uh, yeah, so if you guys are new to my channel, I'm Lulu. Uh, I do a variety of survival games as well as, uh, you know, other games I can jump around between, you know, MMOs and RTS and all kinds of other stuff. But for the most part, I st usually stick to, you know, survival games. So we are playing Enshrouded, which is basically kind of like Valheim in a way, except different. Yeah, different. So, yeah, um, I was debating about doing a stream on the game. Um but I decided to keep my streams limited to uh, stuff that I that requires a lot of behind the scenes things that's just a little bit easier to do. Um, but uh, if you guys watched my last episode, you would have noticed that we started building the house um, and we traveled a little bit, uh, but we didn't go very far. Well, I did finish the house behind the scenes. Uh, I played around with that a little bit. We got ourselves a bed and a little fireplace right here. Um, we got, you know, that we moved our our little flame indoors uh, we got a little storage area and our crafting and um so i don't know if this is done on purpose or not though but it's going to be bright when we walk outside um there's a little bit of a lighting issue ow my eyeballs when you first walk outside and it is a little bit of a little bit of a little bit bright just a wee bit bright during the daytime so um during the last episode we uh we did episode one basically um we did the long keep uh, i did go back through there and i did clear it all out of course everything did respawn so kind of pointless but um um and kind of behind the scenes while i was doing stuff i got the glider yeah i did that um but i kind of want to go down into the into the mist down here uh below the bridge and i want to head over to this guy um which is, I don't know, what direction is that? Over there? Yeah. I want to kind of head over there to the sleeping uh, survivor. I'm not entirely sure where he is over there. I think he's pretty far beyond the mist. But I just kind of want to head that way and see what we can see. Um, so the bridge over here, we could... I do have the grapple. So just to kind of show you guys here real quick. Um, press I, backpack uh character so we do have our glider and our grapple hook now um we are level two i put points into um survive survey survivor um and wizard um so for healing and magic uh so the blue path is what i'm focusing on right now because i think i'm gonna go with a magic build for our starting build um other than that i really haven't done too much i did a lot of grinding a lot of resource farming um as you can see, I've got some of that on me, some food on me. Uh, I got some of these boom, boom orbs. <laughs> um, when I went through, I went back through the uh, starting tunnel and I found a hidden passage that um, I didn't grab originally. Uh, and I went in there and I ended up, uh, yeah, getting, getting some stuff out of there. got those bombs that you can destroy walls and stuff like that with them. It's pretty cool. Um, is that for the grapple? Oh, it is. I did not notice that. Is there another grapple point somewhere? Oh, right there. Oh, that is cool. Like a Assassin's Creed. All right. Oh, some wooden arrows and some bandages. Climb up this mesh. Yes, we can. Metal mesh. All right. So it looks like we're traveling this way, just above the mist down below. I don't want to see what's up here. I haven't been up here yet. Looks like uh, an old house. It's like stacks of logs or twigs. That was the fence. It's not letting me destroy it. I just want to destroy it. There we go. Oh, plant fiber. Not a whole lot. I thought it would be more. 
Oh, we already had a little bit on us, but that's cool. Some plant fiber. Oh, these look like they explode. Oh, okay. Oh, what is this? This looks like resin or honey or something in the wall. Interesting. Okay, well, we have this orb. Let's see. <laughs> that was a lot bigger than I thought. Looks like we got a chest with a executioner's axe. Interesting. Interesting indeed. Uh, did that go into my inventory? It did. So this is a 21 damage axe. Melee weapon level 3. I'm pretty sure I need to be a higher level to use this. Two-handed. Interesting. Looks like there's another one of these things right here. We gotta be careful. Oh, there's some books. Grab those old books. Sometimes you get broken glass shards. Oh, some loot here. Some more shard pieces. Looks like from a dead survivor. Oh, there's some more of those boom orbs. Yeah, that's what I'm talking about. I mean, I'm not going to break everything, but we're not going to look around. A dead wolf. Looks like a tamed wolf. It's got a collar. Oh, yep, there's a grapple hook. I was like, you know what? I'm just going to check just to see. All right. Read this. Awesome. Careful with this shipment. Some more boom boom orbs. Yes. More arrows. Another book. Awesome. Okay, cool. Not a whole lot. But hey, I, I'll take all those boom boom orbs. It's, uh, yeah. Oop, there's a wolf over here. Now, does this wild wolf actually have? Ooh, that hurt. Ooh. Okay. So, uh, that hurt. <laughs> Did not expect to get hit that hard. Use a bandage real quick. Okay. Interesting. So, level three is up here. So, we got to be careful because we are not level three. Oh. Oh, bees. Nice. Took those bees out quick. Pick up that honey and wax. I was like, what was attacking me? Okay, so the guy we need to get to. Is he over there at that tower? I think he might be at that tower over there. Something going on down there. Probably going to regret this. I think this is like an enemy camp. Ouchie, that hurt. Gotta hit E first. <laughs> Rockmore. Oh, shit. Woo! 
<laughs> yeah, I don't think I would have been able to take them on melee. That was pretty fun. Let's see what's in here. More boom orbs. Mysterious flasks. And nothing really there. Oh, there's some books. Ah, there we go. I was able to get those books. Well, this big axe has some use, I guess. I don't need the water. No. <laughs> awesome. Whatever. We got water. Uh oh, combat. Oh, he's up top. Is he coming around? Door. Oh shit, he's got some fucking gun. Crossbow. <laughs> that could have ended badly. That is a trap if I've ever seen one. <laughs> oh, hello. <laughs> All right, so these guys, they're not that they're not like uber uber tough, but they definitely uh they definitely hurt. They're a level above me right now. Um and I blew open a hole in the mountainside there. Pointless? Pointless. I just walked right through there. There was a bed here to lay down on. Oh, I didn't want to use that. Darn it. Can I break this with that? Or do I need to use an orb? Probably need an orb. There we go. Just blew open half the wall. What did that say? That's something. Chest. 
Well, I got back from one of my orbs. Doesn't really look like there was much down here. Okay. Um, take the ladder upstairs. <clears throat> oh, another chest. Ooh, greater health potion and another orb. Well, I got my orbs back. That's cool. Well, if there's anything else in this camp, I don't know where it is. Um, I want to use the big axe on this guy up here. There's actually quite a few of them here. Oh, hell no. I think I do more ma more damage with my magic because of uh, my increased points that I put into it. Now be careful, I know there's a guy behind me. Yeah, I saw him back there. He's got the, the that bow thing. So, um I don't have another another wand on me. And this one's about to break. Yeah, I can see the way he's standing. He's got that big repeater bow. There we go. Nice. Another chest. Ooh, three more of the boom boom orbs. Oh, hello. Is that a pelt? Animal pelt. Uh, water, lots of wood scraps. What's that? More water? More water. It's a, just a back way up here. Alright. Oh, hello. Something tells me... Uh, use transferring of tools or explosives. Okay, so I have to use more of my own to get through here. Okay, well, I just made an open path right there. Now we're up here. <clears throat> we're kind of going off the beaten path here. Obviously, I wanted to get over to that other tower for a potential survivor. Let's see what's in here real quick. Oh, there's a chest. Looks weird, though. Ooh, I got a new wand. 14 damage. Just when our other one's about to break. Um, backpack. Where is it? Right here? So, 11 to 14. Hey, it's a jump. I'll take it. So, can I get all these books without breaking the shelf? I don't know what these books are for. I'm just grabbing them. But something tells me they have a use later in the game. I have no idea. I'm just assuming. Oh. Ooh. It's on fire. Whoa. Rock more. Poor guy. Oh. There's a lockpick tool. Sickness and in health. Aw. Okay. Oh, another book. Did I get it? Are they going to let me? Yep, there we go. Cool. No idea what these are for, but I'm just grabbing them. Oh, use the lockpick to get out. Not sure if that was actually needed to be done. I probably could have broke the door. Okay, cool. When we wiped out this camp, that was pretty interesting. Careful of those boom booms right there. Um, let's see. 
And then we have to go that way. I'm pretty sure that's the tower we have to go to. That's what it's telling us to go to. Yeah. Um, we might have to cross the bridge for that. I don't think we can get to the tower from over here. Oh, there's loot. There's the other body I couldn't find. Is this a chest? Had some more metal shards in it. Cool. Another boom boom. Okay, okay. Ooh, another chest. A hunter's bow. Oh, my backpack is full. Um uh, delete. There we go. Got more notes. Okay. Whoa. Oh, that's that part I blew up. Okay. Um. Okay. Well, let's see if we can get to that tower. Cleared out this random camp here. So I think we have to go back over here to the bridge. To get to there. There looks like there's a way up right here. Possibly. There's definitely a way up up there, but I'm not seeing one here. Can I climb this? No, I can't. Can I? No. Oh. Hmm. Hmm. Hello. Never mind. There we go. Oh, I'm going to fall. Okay. We got to wait for stamina. Rush in here. Okay, still rushing here. All right, let, let's 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 chill for a minute. <laughs> there we go. Um. Can I go up and over this mountain this way? Sweet, sweet. New location. There's a house here. Little hut of some kind. Oh, yeah, yeah, we were here. This was the boom hut. Okay. Yeah, yeah. Oh, one shot those bees. Was there another beehive? Huh. Well, it looks like it's about to be nighttime. Or, uh, it is nighttime. <laughs> Alright, well, we made it back to our house just as nighttime hit. Alright, home sweet home. Left our door wide open. All right. A few extra things. What's this do? So the elixir we got, uh, plus thirty percent to damage multiplier. To damage, um, minus one minute maximum time in the shroud. Okay. Interesting. And then we got meat from the wolf. Look that real quick, maybe. Oh, we're cooking the lean stuff though, but meh, it all works. Uh, 
Um, let's see. Can we put that down here to cook? There we go. Awesome. Uh, and then stick this honey in here. We got some of that grilled meat. It's actually better. We're low on bandages, but we've got potions. I actually do want to make some more bandages. All right, love you, sweetie. If they say no, make sure you come back. So we need string and torn cloth. There we go. Plenty of bandages now. Matter of fact, I think we made more than we can hold. Nope. Ten bandages. Sweet. <clears throat> All right. Heal ourselves up, and then we'll go try to get to that tower. As the sun's coming up. All right, let's do it. I like how the nighttime, it's like it boosts the speed instead of just like... I, I like how it does it. It's kind of less less uh, skippy and more casual. So yeah, the wolf meat definitely gave us way more food buff or health buff. All right, so let's go to. There's that rock again. Is that that's weird? That's the first time I've seen it over here. Um, where is the bridge? There we go. Hey, another piece of wolf meat. <laughs> All right, so there's the bridge. We have our grappling hook now, so let's see if we can get to the tower. Um, maybe that's where we find our first person. Some strings and fiber. Ooh, look at that. That's uh that's dangerous. <laughs> <coughs> Another dead body here. Some more boom orbs. I see some something. Oh, this must be uh okay. Oh yeah, I see them down there. Is he? I hear him. I just don't see him. He's right there. Adam. All right. Let's go up here to this tower. Oh, something's fighting over there. Something just got murked. I don't wonder what it is now. Oh, the wolf must have killed the rabbit. <clears throat> 
Uh, this road is blocked. A grapple hook is required to cross. Okay. <clears throat> so I can't destroy the wall? Is that what they're trying to say? I mean, it takes damage, so I'm pretty sure I could. Oh, didn't see you. Ooh, he's level three. Oh my god, he almost killed me. <laughs> he almost killed me. Holy crap. guys are tough. I don't think I'm supposed to be here yet. Oh, there's a chest. Rusty sword. Uh, imagine this. Okay, cool. Like I said, guys, I'm not going to read it. I just want to play. Chances are we'll be resetting eventually anyways because of early access. Okay, so this takes us down and around. I want to go up, so we're going to go back. Can I, can I grapple? Thank you. Oh, shh. Why didn't you guys tell me it did that? <laughs> oh, wait. Do I have to go around to get up there? I don't know. Let's, let's check. Um, let's do another bandage. Okay. I think I actually have to go that way. It doesn't look like I can get up from over here. Oh. Something. Oh, bees. I'm like, something just aggroed me, and I don't know where it is. Ooh, here are these uh, flameborn containers. Says he's resistant to magic. Hmm. Try using <coughs> a sword. Let's see, hold up. This is 14, 11. Okay, ancient. All right. shit okay so he has magic resistance okay so these little tables right here allow you to repair your equipment okay interesting Oh, yeah, that's right. I re-key binded my roll. I'm like, where's my roll at? Ancient Vault Blacksmith.
So they take more damage from melee. Okay. <coughs> Venture forth. Awaken survival. Oh, that's a old Odwin. Ooh, summoning staff. Recipe unlocks summoning staff. Um, charcoal at the charcoal kitchen. Ooh, that sounds nice. Is this a door? Ooh, fur chest. Uh, lock picking metal sheets at the forge. Um, mace. A new location charted. Oh. oh. When you need to rest, you can fast travel back to your home by opening the map using M. Navigate to your home. Fast travel. Nice. Convenient. That's pretty cool. Hey, commune with the flame. Uh, this survivor will be with the addition to your cause. Place them into the world with a summoning staff, which then can be crafted from wigs. Oh, no, back up. Uh, okay, so come to the table. Uh, summoning staff can be made with one twig. Okay. Um, I don't have a twig on me, but I have twigs. Um. Twig, 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 twig. Okay. Uh, crafting, summoning staff, craft. Uh, bandages, make it under bandage. Okay. And then, uh, backpack, summoning staff. <coughs> uh, tab, the blacksmith. Hey, hey we got our first survivor. Found sleeping survivor. Quest complete. I don't want to do that. Stop. X. Wait, what? Okay. A long glass. I have returned. A humble blacksmith at your service. Talk and craft. Uh, craft my first gear. Wasn't long enough to find me. Blah, 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 blah. Can make your weapons and stuff. Okay. Uh, cleansing fire. Um, embarking can be a survivor. And starts with the ashes, embers, and kids. Uh, the flameborn. Okay. Craft. Oh, 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 there we go. So the forge, the charcoal kin, nails, uh, failing axe, pickaxe, lock picks. One-handed weapons, spiked club, uh, fur armor, um, dishes. <laughs> uh, didn't see anything else up on those. That's nice. Uh, material equipment. Okay. Um, all upgraded items from your backpack and actions of this. Um, enhancement to unlock new parts. Um, each part does this. Okay. So we got rusty sword, all the stuff that we already have. Hatchet. So he can enhance it. Plus he can also do what the normal bench can already do. Uh, well rested. Uh, new gear. Confused with fall asleep. Interesting. Interesting. All right. Well, fight fire with fire. That's cool. Well, at first I thought these guys would be like standing around your base and do stuff. But uh, no, they just, they're just here. Um, I need more twine. Um, why is this giving me an exclamation mark? Um, you have wakened your kin. The flame is present. Seek out more survivors slumbering in the lands. Interesting. Okay. 
No, we don't want to do that. Okay, it just had another thing to tell me. Well, anyways, <clears throat> that is going to call it for today, guys. Thank you for watching, as always. Um, I'm just winging it as we go. I have no plans per episode. Um, today, I just kind of wanted to go see what this soul survivor thing was about, and we managed to get ourselves a hold of the blacksmith so we can do weapon upgrades as well as make armor now and uh, get some little bit more defense we can look into getting like the fur armor and stuff like that which i'm really excited for um so yeah where's that the fur armor down here which should give us more defense oh yeah give us a good chunk of more armor which should help drastically uh it's level five armor so i don't think we can wear it just yet but uh yeah <laughs> and anyways guys thanks for watching as always and don't forget to like subscribe for more content if you guys are wanting to watch more of in shroud or any other game that i might be doing on my channel i've got a few that are going right now but i uh, appreciate it as always don't forget you can join my discord where you can find information on any servers that we might have up and running as well as uh talk to other members in the community share information and just play the game and have fun so you can find all that down below in all my videos. I always leave my Discord link in the videos. But anyways, other than that, guys, take care. Peace out. And I will see you guys in the next episode of Enshrouded.